The National Cohesion and Integration Commission says it's closely monitoring political activities in eight counties to ensure politicians do not incite the citizenry using hate speech. We have just mapped out these areas as the ones now where there is a lot of activities going on and therefore we have to be alert. There are officers in the field, uh, the police officers who will be doing the monitoring and who have been doing that. And occasionally we will also be sending officers from, from here once we know the itinerary of some of the politicians. On the right of NCAC is Kiambu, Kilifi, Uwasengishu, Elgeo Marakwit, Beringo, Nakuru, Nyeri and Kakamega counties. The commission says politicians holding meetings in the eight counties should guard against hate speech in the name of freedom of expression. We're going to be with them. They are in the field and uh, we're going to record what they're doing. And if they are within the boundaries, we have no problem with them. Let them go ahead and, and, and just sell their, their ideas and whatever, but let them not cross those lines. The commission has also issued a stern warning to youth being used to spread inciting messages on social media. We need to put a lot of effort in educating people, young people, that if you uh, that misuse of the social media, because some of them don't even know the implications of, of misuse of social media. Number two, some of them don't even know when they are they're going beyond the boundaries, you know? They just think that they're carried, they just get carried away, but they don't know that there are certain limitations, you know, to what they're doing. According to the NCAC Commission Chair Hassan Mohammed, NCAC personnel in all counties have been equipped with audio and video recorders to aid in collecting evidence on those spring head speech. The move, he says, will strengthen their cases against offenders. For Channel One News, I'm Gladys Mongai.